I'm back from my break. Uh, let's see. Need to find Mass Effect. There it is. Let's see. Right. While that's loading up. Hello, everyone. And welcome back to Mass Effect. And Happy New Year. Because right now, this is taking place at 1 a.m. for me. Uh, my previous stream went on a little bit longer, a couple of extra matches of uh, Dead by Daylight, then a short break of me needing the restroom and food. So, uh, yeah, I'm back. I still have the bottle of cider. So cheers. And Happy New Year. I'm I'm loading up Mass Effect now. It's it's gonna take a minute. Uh, I'm a little tired, but I do think I can can tough out. Uh, what you call it? A stream. I still think I have a couple of side quests. I do. I think I need to take out like one more barrier generator somewhere somehow. Yeah, I do remember taking out these places up here. I did not think that through. I can probably get it right here. I 
I guess I could also double check the uh, ones I have. Looks like PB and uh, Four have nothing left to say to each other. I take it this is something I can't cross. Kind of. It gives me a split second. Mm, I don't think I can make up that. Maybe here. Okay, I don't want to go too fast. Oh, now I see it.
building Please don't tell me I'm stuck. As in, like, the game is broken. I really hope it's not busted. I see a uh, building over there, but it looks more like remnant. Let's see. Oh, 
Undocumented mineral nearby, Pathfinder. Okay. Can't say it's used to. Sorry. Finder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Those ones don't have... Please. Since uh, Quorum TV are no longer talking, I may pull in somebody new. shipments are up. A good sign for people trying to live here. I wonder if there was one in this station I just couldn't see it.
Ağzını da kaldır. Hep yapış var. I can make it. Listen to what you said. Vetra, what's up? You keep sighing. Do I? Sorry. Sid called and asked if I can get her a timer, metagel, and 15 pairs of socks. That can't be good. Ah, I made it. memory trigger one of your father's memories is now accessible return to sam node on the hyperion to investigate further Or Pathfinder, we'll shoot. If you're the ones who hid those supply crate thefts, I don't think you want to fight. Disarm, and we'll talk. God damn it. We're waiting. Wise decision, standing down. Who are you? Chase Gannon. Used to be maintenance. Look, we weren't trying to hurt anyone, just like you said. It's why we came back here. We didn't want to be outlaws. We have family on the Nexus. But we didn't think we'd be welcome. Tan hasn't been forgiving. Not that we deserve it. How did you end up like this? What, as exiles? There was no hope. You have to understand. We thought we were all going to die. And when they exiled us, we saw it could be worse. People preying on their own. We couldn't. So we hid out here and thought maybe... I don't know. I don't know, Pathfinder. You admit you were criminals. What choice do we have? Exiled means they kill you if you come back. But we couldn't keep doing it. We're not pirates. We came here to build. All we could do was watch. Watch you build. At least it was something. I can't let this continue. You know that. Pathfinder, we're not asking to continue. Just, we tried. All right? We tried and fucked it all up. Not exactly a nuanced defense. There isn't one. We got scared. We did bad things. We regret it. Maybe we're idiots. Maybe we should never have come here. But we want to believe there's a way back. Not here. Get off my planet. You want a chance? A way back? Tan may not like it, but he's not here. They'll accept that? Let us try? Prodromos isn't in the business of refusing honest help. I'm numb, Pathfinder. I don't know if there are words. Then get to work.
Okay, go the other way. This place is a strain on our gear, but so is everywhere else. and get back up here. Maybe. This looks like hazard this shit. We did it. We've got, got two caches here.
screen if there's any way in. In the bubble. Sarah would be scolding me for bad technique. She taught you just fine. You don't need hand-holding. Just wish I felt steadier out here. All these new challenges. We're making it through. Sometimes that's all you need. report back <laughs> Hold on. Okay. I see, I see.
I want that armor. Already getting requests from the Pedromos labs. Supplies lost to outlaws. Minor recovery, but a bad scene all around. We'll have to be careful. Recommendations noted, Pathfinder. Let's check out the base. If I can only take out one of these, it'll be worth it.
Go ahead, pop your head out. Pop your head up, I dare you. Yeah, I'll come to you. Terminal active. Remain in range. That charger fills my shield. But I heard that I got out of range. Or did I?
Sabotage. And my nervous that. Guys, if you can't do it in one shot, don't do it at all. This place is massive. No wonder they were able to take out sites one and two. That actually scared me.
Probably before Site 1. It takes time to build something like this. Oof. I'll be right back. I need to pee.
I'm back. Hey, Ryuji. Happy New Year. Did this become New Year for you, or has it been New Year's for a while? Uh, I'm back. I had to pee. Uh. All right, let's see. Where am I? For like an hour? I don't like this where's the anointed. Oh there he is. But yeah, it's been two for me. But yeah, happy new year. You doing anything to celebrate? So just like men, hand to hand. I think I need to get up there and call that off. Ah, uh, fun. I don't think I'll have a chance to sleep tonight. Okay, so I am right. Why is everything here? Sounds like a frog croaking.
save myself to go in. Honestly, the reach on that charge, though, as long as you got a decent line of sight. Yeah, this game has no bugs. I mean, it's a good game when it works. I dare you.
out this asshole again. Alright, looks like we gotta do this. <coughs> Sorry. Doesn't seem this way. Oh, 
There's a bunch of containers in here. Protein sludge. Yes, the Breakfast of Champions protein sludge. Yes, look down there. There's nothing outside. smart to keep an eye on this place stay sharp just in case so peaceful around here with the invictor dead Alright, looks like we head out of here. All right, so we only have one more nav point here. Jeez, that did not feel like an hour. It felt like three. Nice dodge back there, Vetra. Very fancy. Thanks. Learned it from a pirate back in the Verge. Did you know him long? About a minute and a half. It wasn't much of a bar brawl. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. The nav point in the initiative researcher's journal points to this location. You no, know, I did come here before. 
I guess I just need. Oh, shit. I wonder what's down there. But. I did clear the first area, I think. There somewhere that That one just fucked my day up. This contains valuable data, Pathfinder. You may want to scan it. I didn't know there was another journal over here. I knew it 
was a long shot, but I still held hope she was alive. All we can do is turn this into Prodromos, like she wanted. Kind of fast travel day with either I'm in the cutscene or for some reason. Oh. Okay, so which way is the way out? This? This way? Fast travel now. Yep. <coughs> Damn, I'm out of water. Let's see where the main story left off. Ascent is go. Leaving Atmo. All clear. I think I got another point to Pathfinder, got a minute? Sure, Stevie. The swelling has gone down significantly, and I seem to be able to talk normally again. Good. Keep me updated. And remember, cool food and liquid only. Nothing spicy. Thank you, Lexi. Lexi and her rules, huh? Hey, I respect Lexi and her rules. She takes care of us. Without her, I might still be wheezing and trying not to choke in my fat tongue. I... What? Have you ever heard of the Lick Test? Back before scanners were portable, Earth scientists would employ this test in the field. They used it to tell rocks from fossils and get a basic idea of their mineral composition. <laughs> you licked a rock, didn't you? I was distracted and forgot it was a Helios rock. I do it unconsciously. When I was little, my father and I would go on expeditions. The lick test was a huge part of it. He made science fun for me. Your mother was something of a scientist, wasn't she? 
She specialized in biotics research. Got her start in medicine. I read all about her research and your father's. AI and implants. They achieved so much in so little time. Sam is an astounding achievement. I left my parents back home. They told me they were proud of me. And then lived out their lives while I slept. If I were them, I'd be proud too. You came here for the sake of science. That takes courage. Some crazy, but mostly courage. I'm sure they knew that. <laughs> Thank you, Ryder. I needed that. Anytime. Cat genetics defies everything we know. They're bits of different species, and yet all cat. It's bizarre, horrifying, fascinating. All at once. Having a hard time keeping up with the hair. Just think, while you're poking around in their genetics, they're probably doing the same with ours. Huh. Wonderful. That's me never sleeping again. <laughs> I should get back to things. Sounds good. Gil, O'Connell and Serena spent months getting our systems coordinated. You can't just strip and redesign those connections on the fly. Gil? I know you can hear me. The whole ship can hear you. I'm just not listening. You're fighting again? I'm thinking the same, believe me. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. I think the AVP is the uh, stuff to which people. Because. Because. Just because. Fine. Hey, Phoebe. Ryder. Exaltation? I never imagined we were fighting Angara. It kills me to think about it. We have to stop the Archon, whatever he's up to. The more we learn, the more I realize how much bigger than me this all is. It's humbling. I like it when you flirt. I wouldn't want you to stop. Have I flirted with you? <laughs> Don't worry, Ryder. I'm relentless. It relaxes me. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it.
see what's up. How are you feeling, Moshe Sefa? Weak, but I'll bounce back. I always have. I've broken each limb twice. You have to do more than wipe my immune system to take me down. Oh, you and my mom would love each other. You still have questions. I'll try to answer them. I'll let you rest. Wait, one more thing. I spoke to a guard, a former resistance fighter who remembered me. It described everything about its past, our past, with no trace of emotion. It seems that victims retain memories of who they were, but after being exalted, they live only to serve the Ket. Does your species dream? Sometimes. The Ket remembers being Angara. Like a dream it's eager to forget, which is beyond comprehension. Ishare, Pathfinder. I'm sure we'll talk again. Well, that's horrifying. Yaksul is very cunning. We can't underestimate him. <sighs> My mothers are worried sick about the cousins that joined him. I'll see you later, John. Stay strong and clear. So, Kalu, who's that woman I keep seeing you with on the Nexus? What? Whom? You're always sharp credits after we come back. Is it because of her? It's complicated, Subi. Uh, yes. Tracking a remnant architect. Apparently, I didn't do naming your dead. Green. So apparently I, I missed the quest. Coordinating, path is calm. Let's see. I think a, a Nexus visit may be the last thing we do. My back's starting to hurt. I need to stretch. But I also need a little bit of rest for tomorrow. Or I guess this morning. That being said. Let's head to the Nexus. Or to the next area. Or maybe I will probably be able to push out till 4. We'll see. Just go. Also, uh, uh, clear. like seizure, seizure, seizure warning coming up. Uh, basically, when I jump from place to place, it. Uh, Track said he wants to talk to you. Okay, we'll talk to Drag first. But basically, when I leave a system, it is very flashy. Read the mission briefs. This isn't good, Ryder. The Archon's dangerous. I've seen people like him before. 
He's definitely dangerous. So dangerous, I'm not sure we're ready to deal with him. Take him out. All we need is a plan. From where I stand, the Archon thinks he knows what's best for us. Problem is, he can follow through on it. That exaltation the Ket do, it turns people into slaves. He can do that to us. He has that power. Someone like him you take out fast and hard. Get the leader, the rest will follow. Honestly, drop a nuke on his head, blow up a sun if you have to, take the collateral damage. I hope it doesn't come to that, but exaltation seems almost worse. If he has his way, there won't be anyone left to save. <laughs> you don't mess around with this kind of thing. Ends badly each and every time. Another galaxy and there are still despots. When I was on security duty at the Relay, colonies were attacked all the time. We trained the colonists and they started fighting back. Raiders didn't expect that. The Angara already know how to fight. But the Archon, he's got an army to back up his crazy. We're the new variable here. He can't predict what we'll do. That is an advantage, so long as we play it right. You keep thinking about how you want to handle this. We'll only get one real chance at it, won't we? Yep, so when we take him down, let's make sure he stays down. I mean, he's not wrong. <laughs> but he's just like, drop a nuke on his head. Blow up a sun. Just get the fucking job done. This is it, be careful. If you're uh, photosensitive, use your warning right now, so get the hell out if you need to. All right. Uh, if you're still here, it's over for now. The water. I'm gonna have to drop a gallon up. So it might take a minute.
See what see what this skill is. I don't know about these Angara. Whoa, it's the Pathfinder. It's me. You're the one who befriended these strange new people, these Angara, and now they're here on the Nexus. How do we know we can trust them? I mean, for certain. Remember, we're the strangers. This is their home, and they've welcomed us. They've earned our trust. I guess. Talk to them. Get to know them. See for yourself. Good advice. I will. Call out for the recent uprising. Sure. Let me know what materials you need, and I'll find you something. That's a relief. Thanks for helping out. I owe you one. Make them hear. Make them know. Make them lead. Hey, what's going on? That's your new galaxy. Making speeches about some fresh start while your kids stay frozen. And it's all thanks to your Pathfinder. Excuse me? We've waited months for our families to come out of stasis. They should have gone to your outpost. But since you think research is so important, military personnel got bumped down the list. Like my clan, brothers. All the reassignments mean they're in ten different colony blocks now. And my mother just got caught in the middle. We only had resources for one outpost, so I focused on the skills we needed most. And what we need is our families back. Maybe you could still make this right. I just want Mom out of stasis. That's all anyone here wants. You do stasis revivals. You can tell our leaders you're opening those pods. Today. I authorize whole colony blocks or a few emergency revivals. I can't wake dozens of random people. We don't care whose finger pushes the button. If you can't, our leaders can. And if you tell them, they will. Okay. I'll talk to the leadership about what we can do. 14 months of promises. It's time for some results. We tried petitioning Addison. She ignored us. Screw her. Start with Kandros. He sent those ten soldiers over there. Maybe he'll take us seriously. Make them hear. Make them know. Make them leave or make them go. Any word? No, no. What you got? So, folks try and help and all, but we have a limited pool of ingredients. Keep an eye out for anything interesting we could use for new drinks, and we'll let you test them for free. Right. I get a feeling the testing will be interesting. Don't worry. Dutch may complain a lot, but he's loving it. And he's the best chemist I know. You're in good hands. So, Ryder. Big news. I think I found my purpose in life. Oh, yeah? What's that? Uh, thrashing you at poker? Shall I deal? Ryder, I can read Bill's vital signs and give you an advantage during the game if you like. Don't. All right. You can deal first. Having fun? Getting my ass kicked is what I'm doing. Poker's lost me several friends over the years. The only one who still plays me is my buddy Jill. I I know, I know. Jill and Gil. Is Jill a masochist? Part of the initiative? Yep. 
Been awake since the start. Jill's a fatality expert. Heads the initiative CRC. My only real friend from back home. I bet 50. I call. The CRC? Colonial Repopulation Committee. She's always teasing that I'm making her job harder. Says if I'm not making babies, I'm part of the problem. We have that kind of relationship. Hmm. Sounds kind of disrespectful. It doesn't bother you? Nah, she's like family. Supports me unconditionally. We just ride each other like that. You should meet her. You'll see. She's amazing. Another hundred. Ah, I fold. Another one for me, then. Well, that's that. You win. I've achieved my true purpose in life. What will I do now? Revenge will be mine. Someday, maybe. Jill predicted you'd be my downfall. Can't wait to tell her she was wrong. Another streak intact, I'll say. Ouch. Have fun. And thanks for the game. I'll see you back on the Tempest. Things are shaping up, Pathfinder. Resources flowing in, sleepers ready to head out. It's starting to feel like the initiative. Not quite up to the sales pitch, but getting there. Feels good, right? I feel it, Leo. Finally getting our start. There we go. Getting our shit together. Yeah. We're showing the new galaxy that we have it sorted. <laughs> if I keep saying it, it's true, right? Let's go get the pie, Jack. Here we are, one young pie, Jack. Ready to see Andromeda, huh? Sam, can you send a note to Kesh? Make sure our new friend gets delivered to the Tempest. Acknowledged. Is it the project on the campus? I think Sam Node has something for me. I forget where Sam Node is. Like which Welcome deck is which. The space during repairs on the Nexus Hall. The victim's name has been withheld until next of kin in the Milky Way is notified. This is H and S. Pathfinder, be advised the Angaran AI from Vault is now active and mostly cooperative. Ryder, one of your father's memories is available. Let's see it. This memory is from when your parents returned to Earth after your mother was diagnosed with her disease. It's simple. We take Sam. Who? I named the AI. Simulated Adaptive Matrix. Sam, we use your research and interface Sam with an implant. Um, my work on biotic implants was yielding results, but this, I don't know. What did the doctor say? Alec. What did he say? It's getting worse. There's your answer. This will work. Sam can fix you. Alec, I'm not some war you have to win. You're not an N7 anymore. That doesn't mean we- They kicked you out of the Alliance for this. We're talking about your life. Alec, did you ever consider that maybe it's my time to go? I'm human. 
We die. It happens. Ellen, please. Losing you is not an option. The kids aren't gonna lose their mother. God knows they never had a father. Then give them one. They just ask for a refund. So can this Sam talk yet? Hello, Helen. Why did the tree go to the dentist? Um... To get a root canal. <laughs> Humor algorithms. I can't seem to get the hang of it. Or maybe it's the guy teaching them? <laughs> I gotta remember I that one. Real. Mom was right there. Alive. It was the first time I met Ellen. My education on human mortality began that day. Your mother seemed prepared to die. But Dad wasn't ready. Mom was just trying to prepare him. Even though all human beings one day expire. Yeah, but when it's someone you love, it's not that cut and dry. I'm beginning to understand where your father's resolve came from. Private audio logs are now available in your father's quarters. Your progress as Pathfinder has unlocked an additional memory. Let's see it. This memory is of a family gathering on Earth. Finally, the Ryder clan in one room. It feels like it's been years since we were together. Or more. Well, I'll take whatever I can get. I've missed you two. How are you feeling, Mom? No, we're not doing that. There's only one rule for this visit. No talking about me. I'm fine. And when I'm not, the pills help. Deal? Okay. Good. Let's talk about something else. Alec? Um... Really? Well, uh, you're both looking... taller. Yeah, Dad, that does tend to happen. Right, right, I know. So, um... I heard the Alliance has a new Mako in the works. Yeah, word is they can airdrop this one from a ship. I know. They're saying we might get one on our next expedition. You still poking around the attic in Traverse? It's amazing. We think we might have found a Prothean site. No artifacts yet, but we're still digging. Ah, oh, I remember the day they found the first ruins on Mars. Changed my life. We knew for sure that aliens were real. We <laughs> just had to go find them. Yes, every day I wake up, I'm looking at a Mass Effect relay, and I keep thinking, what's on the other side? Don't lose that. The minute you stop wondering what's beyond the mountain, you die a little inside. No chance of that. It's in our blood. You infected us. <laughs> what was, was that to our like sister? When you went through that first relay. <laughs> Don't believe the stories. The Garon relay scared the shit out of us. Admiral Grissom included. Why don't we go have this dinner your mom's been slaving over all day? I'll tell you all about it. I remember that. Mom complained the Ryder clan was never in the same room at the same time. Odd, considering you were family. People get busy. Sarah and I were trying to start our lives. A course that seems to have been influenced by your father. Yeah, good or bad, your parents rub off on you. A form of symbiosis? Sure, I suppose. Though not always beneficial. It gave rise to you. Jury's still out on that. Nevertheless, the emotional bonds among family became clear to me that day. I detect additional memories that they are currently locked. They may yet hold answers. Okay, I'll keep working on it. That's all for now. Of course. All right. See what this audio log has to say. Your father's personal logs. Give me that, Alec. We've heard enough of you talking. Right. So, here's the irony. My research on biotic implants and ESO caused this stupid disease. But maybe it'll save me, too. No maybe about it. Hey. This is my secret log. Anyway, the right type of implant joined with the right type of AI could actually bolster human physiology. 
Even as the disease is trying to kill me, the implant and Sam are counteracting it, keeping things balanced. Result? I get to hang around a little longer. Maybe collect on all those anniversary dinners this guy owes me. As a Corian and historian, how do you view your people's reaction to the Geth? Well, we banned artificial intelligence, which was understandable, but that was taking a hammer to a rather delicate nail. Which was what? The very thing that sparked the revolt. The first Geth who asked us, Creator, does this unit have a soul? But how could it have a soul? Geth had no meaningful perceptions of the world or diversity of experiences we take for granted. Worse, the Geth saw us as the Creator. The revolt was inevitable. We were their superiors. And they resented it. Ryder, Darlemon says you're looking for me. It's not every day an XN7 looks for the Shadow Broker. Anything can be had, provided you can pay. Especially when the tech involves artificial intelligence. The Council will have specters all over my ass if the Cats win in this. Translation, I'll get you the code you want, but the price just doubled. If you try to renege, I've got people. People with guns. Like, okay. How about this? 25% you send the people with guns and see what happens to them. I had to sneeze. And I also had to pee again. Be right back.
see if there's any other quests on the Nexus. I, I think I do have to go talk to, uh... Milky Way hops back to the orchard. Uh, basically, when I'm done with the quest on the Nexus, I think that's where I'll stop for now. But who knows how long that will be? Because I haven't been here in a while. Some Milky Way hops, though, and get some beer. Wow, where did you find those? Never mind, don't answer that. I think they're straight from the Milky Way. Drinks are fizzing tonight. The, yeah. Another one! Damn it! This is supposed to be the chemistry lab. My chemistry lab. You all keep crawling out of the woodwork like space cockroaches. You say that, Dutch, but here you are, pouring people drinks. Uh, hi. I'm standing right here. They're guinea pigs, damn it! Chemists should have guinea pigs. Not have their labs taken over by people giving them things and... and being nice. Bad people, giving you free things and helping you set up. So inconsiderate, right? They keep bringing things, tables and chairs and this bar and lights. Wait, you're making fun of me, aren't you? <laughs> the Dutch put you off. He's a sweetie, really. I'm not. And the drinks are good. Damn right they are. Uh, I mean, <sighs> yeah, I'm a dirty squirrel. You're back. People happen when you work at a bar. <laughs> Got you there, Dutch. I'll have to get used to you too, I guess. <laughs> Fine. You can be a regular. What's your name? Scott. I'm Dutch. That's Anan over there. Be careful. The snark is strong with that one. Snark is good. I can work with snark. Ugh. You're one of those. <laughs> Looks like you're outnumbered, Dutch. You'd think people would reconsider picking on the guy making the drinks, but no. Speaking of, want to try this one? I'm going to call it the Tall Moose. You again. Oh, I mean, hello. Welcome to my lab. Bar, whatever. Oh, Dutch, look at you, getting all used to things. Things are fine. It's people I don't like. They talk back. Serve more drink. Maybe they can't resist your charm. I hadn't thought of that. Wait, you're messing with me, aren't you? I would never. Right, here, <laughs> have a drink. Rotten scoundrel. Hey, now. The drink, not you. Welcome to the vortex. Drink of the hour is a lucky leprechaun. Wanna give it a shot? How lucky are we talking here? I forget where the ingredients are from. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Excellent. <laughs> this kills me.
critical mission failure. Looking good there. I kind of got 50 XP for that. I just wanted me to put points in, but I'm trying to save literally one point. Alright. So the operations, I think that's where... So that's what the Ked are up to, transforming people into willing slaves. Now we know why they take so many prisoners. Well, they're sure as hell not taking any more. I need to talk to you about Stasis Revival and those protesters in hydroponics. I see. Maybe I should get the others for this. Protesters have seized hydroponics? They want their families out of Stasis. The outpost on Eos disrupted the schedule. They're scattered across colony blocks, dozens of people. The protesters want this fixed today. The realities of our position are... We can't wake those families. We don't have the resources, and there's nowhere to put them. Then what's the point of all those outposts I've founded? People need more than space, Ryder. They need work they're trained for, and we don't have placements for those families. If I just toss them to any outpost with a spare bunk, they become a burden we can't afford. What do you suggest? Leave the families in stasis where it's safe and get those protesters out of hydroponics. They seem sympathetic, but so did the exiles. We can't risk another revolt. Survival is more important than family reunions. What would you do with the protesters? I'd send in a squad and march them out. At gunpoint, if we must. If they resist, a few might land in medbay, but it's better than losing hydroponics, or the Nexus. Do you think these protests could turn violent? We're all pioneers. Even civilians are tough enough to start something. And interfering in hydroponics threatens our oxygen supply. They know that. Right, end the protest. I have a feeling that will create more bandits, but at the same time, they are right. Um, like, oh, sorry. Yeah, like, it'll make more bandits if I don't wake the families up. No, the protesters are right. But I have a feeling that will strain resources. Ideally, like, they said they were military personnel. And ideally, I wouldn't mind waking them up and sending them to the outpost if they agreed to be 
at that outpost as security. But it's, they're like, no, that is not an option. Listen, they do want their family. Honestly, the research center does need security. So I wouldn't mind waking them up if, you know, they agree to work security. That's my take on it, but this is definitely like, like dead if you do, damned if you don't. These people aren't the enemy. We didn't come all this way to rip families apart. We'll manage the resource squeeze somehow. Your compassion is admirable, but... Guess we're all tightening our belts. You can run a stasis override command from operations. I hope the rest will be that easy. Tell me I assist. I have a specific person I want brought out of cryo. Name and designation if available. Let's keep this between us. Here's the info. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? Another time. Pathfinder. Maintenance crews, please report to the commons area. Yes, Pathfinder? I've been digging, and there are serious concerns about Spender. And this relates to your job as Pathfinder how? It relates to your job. <sighs> Three, four, five... Right. I've had a year and a half of doing everything with nothing. A thousand people riding me. Spender, shit as he is, helps. So, Pathfinder, if you've accusations to make, be certain. I'll drop trouble like a hot rock, but I can't lose people over suspicions. We don't have the people left. Director Addison? Goodbye, Pathfinder. Well, who has to speak with me? It wasn't you. We're done here. What is it? Well, you're out there, facing the cat. We hear only rumors making them out to be monsters. Maybe they just don't understand us. Do you think peace could ever be possible? The cat seems set in their ways. 
So it would be up to us to change? If they have their way, they'll change us into them. That's what they do. Oh, I see. We must continue the fight then. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Okay, sending the override command. The stasis pods should start unlocking. You're really doing this? I was at the protest in hydroponics. I thought we'd just get more excuses. But we already lost a year waiting for our families. I'm glad it's time. Things will be lean for a while, with the new mouths to feed. But you're out there. We'll manage somehow. My mom was scared something would go wrong and she'd be awake in stasis all that time. She isn't... It doesn't work like that, but I just want her out, so I know. Override complete. Stasis revival triggered on the Nexus. The Jasper K, Griffith G, Hilkvist A, Demerchi P, Kozlov S. There. That's her. Why are you still here? Go be the face your mom wakes up to. I will. Thank you. Give a new resource allocation. Personnel in stasis on the Hyperion may now be required to wait longer. When it's time, you'll have a home to wake up to. I promise. Oh, hey, I leveled up. So now you can stop bugging me about putting points in. See, I do think the uh, damage bonus might be better because I do a lot of melee after I hit him with it. Let's see, I forget what the next one is. Is it 70 or 78? I think that's 78. So I need to figure out something to... So it slowly gets bigger. Okay, I said that there's shit going on in hydroponics again. Let's see what happens. And let's go ahead and do the uh, things I need to do. 
upon the Tempest too. At this point, definitely good to stay for the rest of the hour. There's several disobedience here. Just when I've balanced the air mix, another Yahoo has to come wandering through. Aren't you the Pathfinder? Dr. Camden, head of hydroponic sciences. Mind the seedlings. Are you always this rude to people walking in? Only when a mistake could kill everyone on the Nexus. What do you mean? <sighs> Hydroponics is our air, food and water. A frail green line between us and oblivion. We almost lost it all during the mutiny. Now it's my responsibility. I know what surprise responsibility can be like. So I hear. Perhaps we could share our burdens. I need samples of Andromeda's plant life. Our own specimens should acclimatize to them. Bring me any plants you find. You'll have a bounty in return, and my thanks. What, plant samples? There's a sentence. Board the Tempest, if you know what I mean. I should probably save. I haven't saved in quite a bit. Turian? That explains so much. What's that supposed to mean? Here we go. You know, how uptight you are. I am not uptight. Not even 300 years old and fussing at us like a matrix. I'm a doctor. Fussing's part of the job. Oh, I hear the pie jack. Pie jack. That's a pie jack. Looks like our pie jack friend got out of his cage. He'll be fine, won't he? The exercise will probably do him good. I had to get the pie jack, if you know what I mean. Now, exaltation. The cat just keep asking for more trouble. Looks like pictures of the exaltation chamber. Yeah, the kid are using some Angaran made medical equipment. Could be a lead. I just want an edge on those cat bastards. If they ever got their hands on Sid, I'd. Well, imagine if it was Sarah. I don't know what I'd do. We're all that's left of our family. Same here. Sid was so little when our father left, and I was. Well, her age now. You raised your sister by yourself? That can't have been easy. Had to. I waited forever for our father to come home. He never did. He was involved with some bad things. Bad people. Eventually it caught up to him. There was nowhere to run. Not like a whole new galaxy. Is that why you came here? 
When you're young and stupid, you make bad decisions. Piss off the wrong people. That sort of thing never goes away. Not for you, not for the ones you care about. I don't want to not come home one day. Come on, you're strong, smart. It'll take a lot to keep you from coming home. Strong, smart, but maybe just lucky. Luck runs out on you. I won't. I have a good feeling about you, Ryder. <laughs> I should get back to work. I'm Talk building to the harem. I've heard anything. Chat later. Like, she was just like, well, I actually don't know what to say to that. Finder. We can talk more later. Sure. I think Gil was looking for me. I still need to find Liam. Hey there. Hey yourself. Question for you. Shoot. When all this craziness is over, you think you'll have kids? Where the heck's that coming from? Jill. The best friend I mentioned while I was thrashing you at poker. She's starting the initiative's first repopulation effort at Prodromos. It's all she can talk about. It got me thinking. At the end of the day, this whole thing, the Andromeda initiative, it... We're basically here to spawn. It took you this long to figure that out? I, I mean, he's not wrong. I didn't really think this thing through. But nothing we do here really matters unless we survive. Jill's right. At some point soon, we better get busy making babies. True enough. Who knew this thing was just a glorified dating service? Oosh. The biological imperative is kind of a bummer. There are other ways to reproduce. It doesn't have to come from a romantic relationship. I guess I could donate DNA or however it works. You know me. Whatever my artificial insemination. I do. I don't look back. My mom says that's how my dad was. I wouldn't know. His gun moved on before I was born. I had no idea. It must have been hard. Hey, I turned out all right. He did his part. Brought me into the world. Maybe that's enough. Thanks for talking, Ryder. Now where's William? Actually, where is Liam? Retro... Ah, he's in the, uh... What you call it? With Jal. Like the crew quarters. Oh, I forget what that place is called. I also forgot that I had to go around the goddamn thing. <laughs> Are you happy here? Yes. The Pathfinder lets me tinker. I took apart something called a blow dryer. It's more valuable tech than it seems. We're going to have words when she's gone. I got a copy of the Nexus's movie library. Thanks. I'll look through it. It's probably all agricultural learning vids, but there might be something good. I'll keep you posted.
Near the Nexus apartment? Alright, let's go see PB. I remember she, she said she was working on something. I'm going to do it. I run all the tests. It's non-toxic. If we're going to live here, someone has to take the plunge and actually try to eat things. Dr. Tapero, please do something. Don't do it, Suvi. You told on me. I thought we were friends. You, sir, are uninvited from all my parties. Like, she's kind of not wrong, like, hey. Like, will this fuck my day up? Okay, there's something called the firefighters. Here as well. I mean, like, it's kind of background, like, and heavily glossed over, but the whole, like, dextro DNA thing, like, they can only eat, uh, like, certain foods that others can't. I mean, it made a huge joke of it with, uh, Holly in the apartment mission. Who this ping me? Kind of. Alright. I always get mixed up here. Alright. So, P PB has a apartment somewhere. Unlocking. Come on in. Uh, Evie. Sure, that's safe. My project. She is complete. She? Looks like a she to me. Just a proof of concept. I stripped out its remnant command prompts to see if I could power it up myself. It worked. Now I can build a field model with combat protocols that fights for you. So, uh, what do you think? You've outdone yourself, PB. Let Suvi and Gil eyeball it, then fast track the combat model for me. I'd hoped you'd be happy. Oh no, I forgot to lock the. Shit. My, my, Pelisaria. Didn't know you were still using this hole. Who's your friend? Kalinda, this is Ryder. Oh, everyone knows the human Pathfinder. I meant, who's your remnant friend? None of your business, Kalinda. Of course it isn't. That's what makes it so interesting. Don't be so hostile, babe. No reason we can't all be civil, right? Exactly. But you are kind of trespassing, so... Now, now. I was just concerned something might have happened to my dear old friend. I'm sorry for the intrusion, Pelisaria. I'm just relieved to see you moving on. Ta-ta. I'll walk you out. So, want to talk about it? Oh, Kalinda and I go way back. We joined the initiative together. For a long time, we were like family. Now we're not. When you live a thousand years, Ryder, people come and people go. Entanglements are silly. Just like places. Time to pack this one up. I'm done with it. Alright. I'm actually gonna go away from PB. She, I don't think she's waifu material. Not after what she told Cora. 
But how can you give all this up? Ha! Watch me. Easy come, easy go. I'll pack up my new pet and essentials. See you back on the Tempest. Alright, so I said that there's a quest called Firefighters. There we go. On hold, wait for an email from Knight. Okay. Alright. That seems like a decent place to, to leave off. Before we... Because chances are, if I land somewhere else, it's, it's going to take a while. And that's like the only thing holding me back right now is I do need to get a little bit of rest. Aye. But let's find out who to raid. Uh, let's go ahead and close this. It's going to take a minute to uh, close up. So, again, hopefully your guys' New Year's was eventful. Uh, mine was nice. It was fun. It was a good day. We... Uh, we did some D&D, &D, so, you know, like every other Saturday, so that's why I was a little bit later with the World War Z in the shop. But, yeah, that, it was, it was a, honestly, I did like, uh, this setup this time, so. So, yeah, it, it was definitely a blast. Like, I'm new to D&D, &D, so I don't know how to properly critique it. Like, other than, like, uh, yeah, it felt a little bit this way. Like, a little bit forced. But I don't have anything to base it off of. Since this is all new to me. Anyway, that being said, let's find someone to raid. Alright. Let's see who we got. Um. Uh, up, up, up. Opes is around playing Animal Crossing. Brownie's around. I haven't seen you on in forever. Someone called that magic goat. Uh, apparently, because they're not on. Uh, let's see, Ray Ray. Senpai. Oh, so sweet. So sweet. Why did I follow yeah. you? That sounds so wrong, but wow. yeah, it says like I don't know why. Andrew on the, uh, I don't remember. I remember everyone else. I don't remember you. That low. Look, I don't even qualify. I don't want to. I don't want to tier list my friends. <laughs> I really. Yeah. All right. I think I remember why. Yeah, I haven't been able to see her because I haven't. Like, I haven't had a chance to watch her because I'm just. They've never streamed. So let's see. Close I think uh I think that was fun. I never found a time for it. Four hours, Ray Ray. Thank you, watch for me. But let's see.
Are they after a shiny combi? They may be after a shiny combi. Uh, let me check to see what my recommendeds are and what the hell is that? Uh, see what my recommendeds are and try go to Ray Ray Senpai. I do remember following them now. I like it clicked on who they were. Someone's playing Among Us. Is an item toggle, but it will be an item toggle that moves with you, oh, yeah. so it's kind of cool. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think we usually cut this half an hour or more than this. Can I say we even should have stopped at bar? We'll say hi to Ray Ray Senpai. Uh, you know, since I haven't met her, and it's Happy New Year's, they're playing Violet. I think they're looking for a shiny combi. Uh, hot. shiny hunting's always, you know, more of a just shiny stream, but you know. It's also got that little bit of a endorphin hit, so let's go ahead and then, uh, all right. So that being said, thank you guys so much for watching, lurking, all that good stuff. If you guys are here in the archive or on YouTube, uh, thank you for watching as well. If you like what you saw, please consider leaving a follow or subscribing to be notified when there are more videos. If you want to catch me live, I do normally stream every day except for Tuesdays and Thursdays for now. Uh, we'll see if that switches up this week. or if, yeah, I may just choose a week to uh, get that going, but I also need to get things going for the Ace Attorney. Uh, like basically voice acting. Uh, bad voice acting, hopefully. That's my hope. So look forward to that, hopefully the middle of this month. Uh, so I think that's everything. So yeah, that being said, again, thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope to see you all later. Bye-bye.